Hello, my beautiful Davis and Dave. Princess Grass here. Um, I'm just uh, in my in my bedroom trying on these nails that I I did a review for. Uh, I guess you can see that um, on the little wheel I found at Kmart. Uh, I thought I'd do a, just a quick vlog. It's Monday and Mondays are so hard. Uh, I was talking to, kind of like chatting with somebody, and uh, I did something. My hair is all nutty. Uh, I didn't realize they had already subscribed to me, and I had told her, I said, well, Mondays are like that for me because I can't get myself adjusted unless I get all my coffee, and I hadn't had that much coffee, and I told her, so I'm, I'm sorry because Mondays are hard on me <laughs> if I don't get enough coffee, but I uh, thought I'd just come on and do a quick vlog. I just wanted to talk a little bit about self, I don't know, selfishness or self-centeredness, narcissism. Uh, somebody I know is a real narcissistic person. Uh, and this person I've known for a couple years. Uh, I didn't know when I first met them that they were like that. But it seems like through the years and once you hit if I'm looking away, I'm putting the glue that comes on these nails on. Once you hit a certain age, like midlife crisis, things get a little nutty. And it's just like, you know, some some people will go out and change careers or buy a sports car if they got the money and all that other stuff. It's like they're trying to catch up to their youth or live the life that they think they didn't get to live because I mean, it makes you look back and it's like oh I could have I could have done this I could have been that could have should have would have the most important thing is you should focus on the now and the people around you because you never know life can you life is precious it's something not to be taken lightly uh, but a lot of people, they they might or might not be, excuse me for the shaking around, as mature as you are in your mindset. And I've come to realize that a lot. Uh, it's just, I'm trying to press this now, <laughs> multitasking. Uh, some people don't, I honest to God, think that when, excuse me for mentioning the Lord, well, let me get to the point. I honestly think that some people, no matter what their life experiences are, they don't never, if they've got a certain kind of personality trait like the narcissism, cism, they don't realize things until it honestly smacks them in the face. Uh, I kind of feel sorry for people like that, and I kind of don't. Because it's like it's saying, common sense should tell you. Uh, but, you know, it's like I said, maturity, common sense, it, it all falls on the same, kind of falls on the same thing. Because you're, let's like say, you're old enough to know better. Uh, evidently, some people age don't matter. Um, but I. I had a face of the day video I was going to upload, but I, it's late afternoon now, so it won't be face of the day, it'll be face of tomorrow. Uh, we're trying to get all your womanly duties, and, you know, cleaning and all this other junk and crazy hair. Yeah, I guess that's what you call a cow lick. I can't get that to stay down. Like Dennis Menace had his little hair sticking up on top of his head. <laughs> this is my real hair. It's just natural disaster is more like it. But uh no, I just wanted to I 
bad. I don't know, it's just... Sometimes I'm just speechless on the things I, I'm about a man. Excuse me guys, I know some of you guys are men and all men ain't alike, but it's just some of you just don't have a clue. And the, some of you never will. But I hope and pray that some of these people that are haphazardly living their life without a care to or how it affects other people, uh, like they say, going through the change does not necessarily mean you need to change everything. I mean, you're not supposed to literally take it literal. And like somebody said, go jump off a bridge. That don't mean to literally go jump off a bridge. Going through a change does not mean changing your whole family, changing this. So we're gonna, we're gonna go. If God meant for you to be a high school teenager and act like one, you'd still be stuck as a high school teenager. You wouldn't be, have been given the ability to age and mature and learn from your experiences. That, that's about all I got to say. Have a good day.